or the real goal might be. And then it's time oriented. We're always assigning a date to an action item. If it's to submit 25 press releases, when am I going to have that done? And if I don't have it done by that date, why not? What was I doing? Um, and so that was basically all about the planning, but what I was going to say, one thing that I always thank you for your help, one thing I always have to say to myself is soon is not a time and some is not a number. And that is something I have to say all the time. I'm not going to you know, submit press releases soon or some five volunteers, a hundred volunteers. It's a big difference. So I need to know exactly what I'm going to be doing when I'm going to be doing it. And now I'm going <laughs> to... Out of breath. Um, <laughs> now I'm going to talk a little bit about spe specific tactics that we use to be the pro-choice gorilla in Virginia that I think we are. Um, messaging is a key, key component to anything and everything that I do. If I'm talking to the Libertarian Supper Club or if I'm talking to legislators, I need to make sure that I'm on message. Because if I'm saying what Courtney believes or what Courtney wants to say, then I don't have the strength of my organization, for one thing, behind me, but I also am not getting what I want across. And I included our little training, and this is for some, camp, uh, some college groups that I work with, but I think it fits for any sort of population, if you're wondering what box is, it's our campus organizing groups. Um, so for anything that I do, my goal is to stay on message when I'm recruiting, when I'm training, when I'm doing media, when I'm talking to anti-choice people. Making sure that I'm on point, on message. Um, so, a message is three or four basic themes that you want people to remember or to know. And we always say that it should be motivational, educational, and easy to remember. So, an example of that that I like to say is that when we're talking.